I mostly wanted to ask you about like a lot of influences because I noticed you have a very like jazz bossa nova kind of style. Sure. And I feel like nowadays that's not as common as it used to be like way back. And yeah. I was wondering if your influences kind of stem more from old like original jazz kind of. Uh, admittedly, no. Um, mm-hmm. I know a lot. I know very little about uh, anything, but uh, particularly particularly like older jazz music or anything like that. I play the way I play largely because of uh of um trying to have fun when I play mm-hmm. and also being like isolated. Uh I was in like a like a kind of insular community for a little bit, like Amish people for a bit. And um if you want to play uh music that is sophisticated enough that it's fun for you to play and um you know beautiful enough to like enjoy like other people like listening to the music you're going to you know reach some kind of compromise some kind of balance and end up with a kind of bouncy jazz music Mm -hmm. and i play nylon string guitar because that's a very mobile instrument right um very light uh forgiving nylon you know on the fingers it so it just worked out that way organically So I know you just got, like, finished with the tour. Like, this is, like, your last show. Last this year. is the last show. Thank you so much. Yeah, no, thank you. We're excited to have you here. I just wanted to ask you a little bit about that and, like, what was kind of your inspiration for getting out on the road and how was that whole process for you? Um, it was just leaving the house. I don't like uh, I don't like to leave um, the house that much. But I, I'm so often out of the house. And this, this tour came about because of uh, the South by Southwest Festival. Um, so we were in Texas, we did the, uh, a bunch of unofficial shows, our friend Chandler from Happen Twice booked these shows and, um, he had this whole scheme to do the West Coast and, and, uh, I said, sure, I, um, yeah. That's awesome, I love that. Um, so any upcoming things we should know about, like as far as albums, new music, any upcoming shows, or just anything that you're up to in general? Uh, no, you can forget about me. It's not, it's not, <laughs> it's not that important. Um, but if you like the music and it's helping you, um, there's more that I'm, that we're working on. I, I think I'm, I have like seven songs rocked right now, um, kind of written, recorded, and then I want to make a record called The Charm. I'm working on this album called The Charm. I'd like it to be done, maybe out this year. Maybe uh, maybe it'll come out this year. Maybe come out next year. I don't know. Um, but I want to I want to write maybe three, four more songs. But that's where I'm at. It's a, it's an album. It's called The Charm. It's very, very beautiful, and I'm excited. Yeah. That's awesome. Is that album kind of similar, like jazz and jazz voicings, like pretty color? I mean, like I said, I don't I don't know what jazz even is like i i is it are they is it uh is it you know complex or difficult to play maybe yeah mm-hmm. i have big hands and there's there's range uh is it expressive yeah is it is it is it sentimental yeah you know check it out if you want yeah awesome. thank, hmm? you so much. thank you thank you